Hey everybody, this is Tony B for VideoGameSaga.com. I'm going to talk just a little bit about Night Driver, one of my personal favorites for the Atari 2600, released in 1980. Night Driver was a hugely successful arcade game that was released in 1976. Atari wanted to port it over to their home console system and her Rob Fulop. You can play this game without a timer, like how the video started, or you can play it and get the best score that you can within 90 seconds. There are eight game modes. One through three are persistent tracks. They're the same every time you race them, and you can even memorize them to get better. Game modes five, six, and seven allow you to play those tracks without any time limit, but my personal favorite is tracks four and eight. There's something a little special. Four and eight are random tracks, and they are different every single time. And I'm actually gonna load one up right here and make a complete fool of myself. There we go. Let's see, set it all up good. And you know what? You gotta play it on a timer. You gotta see who can get the furthest on a random track. Some of these turns are absolutely brutal, but I love it. One of the big differences between the 2600 version and uh, the arcade version of Night Driver, uh, the cars were added in, including the, the honking horns as the cars go by as a warning. Uh, the trees and the houses, they're all new to the 2600 version. So this is one of those rare cases where the 2600 version, I think, is actually better than the arcade. But hey, it had four years, so you know you expect some improvements. But it really gives a sense of speed, which really didn't exist in games you know, at this time. Be sure to check out Rob Phillips' Hall of Fame entry at VideoGameSaga.com to learn more about this great game designer.